stay there. Ever wondered why we sometimes go along with the crowd, obey authority figures, or find ourselves persuaded by others? Welcome back to our channel. My name is Esther. If today is your first time on this channel, do well to subscribe and put on the notification bell to receive more insight on human and facts. Today we are delving into the world of social influence. Stick around because we're about to uncover the secrets of conformity, obedience, and persuasion. Have you ever found yourself doing something just because everyone else is doing it? That's called conformity. Picture this. You're at a concert and everyone around you starts clapping and cheering, even though you're not quite sure why. Suddenly, you find yourself clapping and cheering too, caught up in the excitement of the moment. That's the power of conformity in action. It's when we change our behavior or beliefs to fit in with a group, even if it goes against what we truly think or feel. But why do we conform? Well, it's often because we want to be liked, accepted, or simply avoid standing out. Think about it like this. Imagine you're at a party and everyone's wearing fancy clothes. You might feel pressure to dress up too, even if you're more comfortable in jeans and a t-shirt. That's the influence of the social group shaping your choices. Now, let's talk about obedience. Ever heard of the famous Milgram experiment? Back in the 1960s, psychologist Stanley Milgram wanted to understand why people obey authority figures, even when it goes against their conscience. In his groundbreaking study, participants were told to administer electric shocks to another person simply because an authority figure instructed them to do so. Shockingly, many participants complied, even though they were uncomfortable doing it. This experiment reveals just how powerful obedience can be, especially in the presence of authority figures. But don't worry, it's not all doom and gloom. Let's shift gears and talk about persuasion. Ever been convinced to try a new product after seeing a catchy advertisement? That's persuasion at work. Whether it's a celebrity endorsement, a clever slogan, or appealing visuals, advertisers use various techniques to influence our thoughts and behaviors. But persuasion isn't just limited to advertising. It's everywhere, from politicians trying to win your vote to friends convincing you to join them on a new adventure, persuasion is a powerful tool for shaping our decisions and actions. Now, let's delve a bit deeper into each of these concepts. First up, conformity. Did you know that there are different types of conformity? There's informational conformity, where we look to others for guidance when we're uncertain about what to do. For example, imagine you're in a new city and everyone starts running during a sudden rainstorm. You might follow suit because you assume they know something you don't. Then, there's normative conformity, which occurs when we want to fit in and be accepted by a group. This type of conformity often leads us to go along with the crowd, even if we privately disagree. Now, let's talk about obedience. The Milgram experiment isn't the only example of obedience in action. Think about everyday situations where we defer to authority figures, like teachers, bosses, or even parents. Obedience can be both beneficial and problematic, depending on the context. While it helps maintain order and structure in society, it can also lead to harmful outcomes if we blindly follow orders without questioning them. Let's explore persuasion. Did you know that there are countless techniques used to persuade others? From the classic, foot in the door, technique, where small requests are followed by larger ones, to the, scarcity, principle, which creates a sense of urgency by highlighting limited availability. Persuasion tactics are all around us. By understanding these techniques, we can become more aware of when we're being influenced and make more informed decisions. So, whether it's conforming to fit in, obeying authority figures, or being persuaded by others, social influence plays a significant role in shaping our thoughts, behaviors, and decisions. By understanding these concepts, we can navigate the complexities of social interactions more effectively and make choices that align with our values and beliefs. Thanks again for joining me on this journey through social influence. I hope you learned something new and found it helpful. Don't forget to like, share, and comment below with your thoughts and experiences with conformity, obedience, and persuasion. Until next time, keep exploring the fascinating world of human behavior. See you soon! Thank you.